Hi, this is Jim from Pure of Audio. I'm doing an unboxing and review of the Zayer Monitor 2 stands. So I was going to try a video with some still pictures and do some narration to see if it was less work, but honestly it really isn't. But I'm going to go ahead and finish this one out the way it is. So when I got these, uh, you could see the cardboard box is just absurdly industrial strength. It's like three times thicker than most other cardboard. It was like two little tanks coming in the mail. I'm just doing still shots of uh, some unboxing of this. Basically these stands come in three pieces and you're seeing a top plate, you're seeing a bottom plate, and then the main uh, side. And the side has a handle on it that you could uh, unscrew and then it allows you to adjust telescopically out of the top. That's what the final stand looks like as I'm unboxing the other one. That's kind of what we're going for. So it comes with a few screws, some for the top, some for the bottom. And what we're actually screwing into here is the bottom. This is the bottom of the shaft and we're going to screw into the uh, four uh, nuts that you see on the sides and now you can see the plate on there we're screwing those in and then on the side I'm pulling this out unscrewing and pulling it out so I could adjust the actual telescopic part of it so now I've moved that up and now I'm going to attach the top plate so I set the plate on and we just add a screw in and there you have it they're fully assembled and if you have ISO acoustics that you want to add to these and you have a wide version for let's say a Focal Trio or a Twin or an SM9 or something like that uh, I custom made these plates myself uh, but I also have uh, kind of given the pressure on ISO acoustics to actually make aperta plates they call them that will allow you to have a wider base on any stand so it will hold either a PERDAS or the uh, horizontal uh, 430s, uh, the L8 R 430s, uh, or even pucks, which I'm going to be using in my case. I'm going to show you a time-lapse video where we actually install these stands with the isoacoustic pucks, and at the same time, we're also putting in some Gaia isolators with some Focal Sopras, uh, but I'll show you a little bit of that uh, so you can see how it all went. Feel free to email or contact us by phone if you have any more questions.